Hey guys, Richard Allen here, Fleet and Small Business Manager at Harris Oceanside GM in Parksville. First of all, we hope everyone is safe, following government advice, you're all looking after one another. We know this is a very hard time uh, for everyone in the country, uh, but we will get through this. In the meantime, we want to tell you all about this, the 2020 Chevrolet Blazer. So come on, come with me, and we're going to tell you why that should be on your shopping list the next time you're looking for an SUV. So today I have with me the 2020 Chevrolet Blazer. This is one of our demonstration units that is currently being run by our service department. And uh, I thought I'd borrow it for a little while to give you guys a little video of this beautiful vehicle. So the one we're looking at here is, uh, like I say, a 2020 model. It's a demo unit and it's an LT trim. And it's finished in the beautiful incandescent pearl white metallic paint. Now this is a $1,195 option from General Motors. And it is one of our more popular paints, but it's absolutely stunningly beautiful. If you've never seen incandescent pearl white, I do suggest you come down and have a look at it. It is absolutely beautiful. This one also has the Blazer Plus package. So the Blazer Plus package will give you trailering equipment from factory, Sirius XM radio, as well as the power integrated tailgate for power close and open, which is very handy when you have the kids, a hands full of groceries, you can just flip the fob and the vehicle will open. There we go. There's the paint. It's just stunning. I don't know how well that's coming up on the camera for you. Hopefully you're getting a good view here as to what I can see, but it's absolutely brilliant. So beginning with Blazer, you can see this vehicle very much has Camaro-esque design. This vehicle is very much a Camaro on stilts. It's probably the best way to describe this vehicle to you. It has, as you can see, the thin LED daytime running lamps in the spot where you would traditionally find the headlamps. And then in the far corners of each bumper, you see the headlamp assembly along with that massive distinctive Chevrolet grille with the gold bow tie. You can actually upgrade them to the black bow tie package if you choose to do so. So coming down the side of the vehicle again, you can see the uniqueness of the Camaro with those beautiful lines down the side of the vehicle. And again, the Camaro influence comes out again in the driver and passenger side windows all around this vehicle. You can see that narrowness of the windows that is traditionally not what you would see in an SUV. Chevrolet have definitely gone for a very sporty setup on this vehicle. And you can again see how distinctive Camaro has had in this. The inspiration from Camaro is very much there. Again, in the real rear tail lamps as well, with them on with the LEDs, you can just see the, the design and thought that has gone into designing these to give it the best possible and sporty look. So as I said, this vehicle has the power tailgate option as well, which you can open it from the inside of the vehicle or using the fob. And so we're just gonna double click the fob twice and the tailgate's gonna open for us. Now, whether you're traveling light or you are just uh, going on a road trip, this vehicle has got you covered in so many different ways. So the Chevrolet Trailblazer has a maximum of 1,818 litres of cargo space. That's about 62.4 cubic feet of space with the seats down. You can see lots of room in here. This one also has the optional cargo liner package, which is adapted to fit onto the rear seats and leaves cutouts in case you have child restraints or anything you need to attach. To drop the seats, you just go to these levers and you pull the seat down and down they come. Again, do this side as well. And as you can see, you've got pretty much a flat load loading system in this vehicle the whole way down. The Chevrolet Blazer comes in five trims, LS, LT, True North, RS, and Premier. LS is your entry level model. And we have the Premier, which is the top level model, which comes with all the toys and goodies. You can get them in front wheel drive and all wheel drive. So here we are under the hood and in here we have a 3.6 liter V6 VVT. It's one of three engine choices available with the Blazer. On your base LS model, you get the 2.5 liter four cylinder producing 193 horsepower. In the LT and True North models, 
you get the two liter four cylinder turbo, but you can upgrade them to this, the 3.6 liter V6, which has a nine speed automatic transmission. Again, that transmission applies to the two liter four cylinder turbo as well. And this one, the 3.6 liter V6, again, nine speed automatic transmission, 308 horsepower. So whatever your needs are, Blazer has got you covered. No matter what you're going to be doing with this vehicle, whether it's going to be a daily driver or whether it's going to be a vehicle that you use for long or short haul, there's an engine choice for you. So in the rear, lots of space. We can take up to three passengers in the rear, including child seats. You can see the child restraints just under the back here so you can clip them in. We also have the cup holder for the long journeys as well for the big slush puppies and here as well and for most people now have phones so not only do we have USB-C we also have a USB-C charging back here as well now they're charging only they don't connect into our infotainment systems like the front the front connection points uh, these are just for charge only to ensure that you can actually have enough charge in your iPad or whatever device you happen to be using these ones are finished in the ash gray uh, cloth material and it's actually very comfortable very durable you can tell the thought that's gone into it nice little bit of design on here as well as well as the rear floor liners now this is a great package particularly if you have dogs or kids this will really protect your floor you can see it's designed uh, my understanding is they're actually designed by WeatherTech and to the specification set out by General Motors and go in our accessory program and they really do protect the vehicle. So here we have the inside of the Chevrolet Blazer. And as I said earlier, this is an LT model, but it's still very well equipped for an LT model. And coming over back onto the door, you've got your power windows and door locks. You've also got your uh, programmable rear tailgate and you can open and close it from the inside of the vehicle. So when it's set in the three quarters mode, uh, as the tailgate goes up, there is a button on the rear tailgate that you press and hold as it's going up and the tailgate will program itself to that position. That's great if you're a short person or if you just don't want the tailgate, for example, in an underground parkade, you don't want it going all the way up and smashing off the top of a concrete uh, girder or anything like that. Here we have uh, the driver's seat, and you can see the power controls, including lumbar support, which is great. We also have side impact airbags in here as well. Uh, I just come up inside the vehicle here so you can see the inside properly. Um, a lot of nice options you can still add to this one, including the panoramic sunroof, which this one doesn't have. It does open up the cabin and give you a lot more uh, natural light in here, particularly if you live in a part where maybe it's dark and gloomy, uh, you want more light than that. It does add a little bit of uh, natural light there just opening up the cabin a little bit down here we have the electronic part to, uh part brake sorry uh and up here we have the lights and these uh vents as well which remind me very much of a jet engine uh you can see the spindles in there as well they're absolutely fantastic looking leather wrap steering wheel with cruise control and the controls for the uh for the mylink uh, radio system as well so here we have again the interior of the chevrolet blazer very Camaro-esque, as I've said before. You can even see the controls down here for for the HVAC system. You've got, again, your vents down here, USB-A and you and the new USB-C down in here as well. And there is your MyLink radio system. Now, this one is the one that does not have navigation. You can still get built-in navigation in here as well. And uh, we'll just zoom in here so you can have a closer look. There you go. And uh, you've got the home button down here and all your apps based systems in here and of course being a general motors product you have your onstar system an apple carplay and android auto uh, standard fit you don't pay for these with any chevrolet or buick gmc product it is standard across the board allowing you you've got your camera here as well uh, to show you what's right behind you and you can even line up your trailer in there as well so lots of nice little features built into this vehicle and then you have the split screen in here to show you when your phone's paired the radio you're on and if we can slide back that way there you go you can slide over there like like, like, like that so lots of really great features and again the glove box down in here unfortunately you got to put it up manually but uh, still lots of really nice features so here we have the nine speed gear selector 
And then down in here, we have the all wheel drive selector. So you've got two wheel drive, all wheel drive, all wheel drive sport, uh, all terrain mode and trailering mode. Now, if you're buying an, a Blazer LS, LT or True North, you get a the basic all-wheel drive system which basically means that if it requires to send traction to the rear wheels it will do so in really bad weather conditions on the rs and premier models it's slightly different in that it will it's an advanced dual clutch system which means the torque will be sent to the left or right tire with the most grip now that advanced twin clutch system is exclusive to RS and Premier only.